In the summer of 2019, there was a new champion in the ongoing race for the title of biggest container ship in the world, MSC Gulsun. Up until mid-2019, the largest container ships in the world were the 21,413 TU OOCL Hong Kong and her sister ships, 399.87 metres long, 58.8 metres wide and capable of carrying the equivalent of 21,412 20-foot containers. That's in a mix of 20 and 40-foot long boxes. These ships have a dead weight of 191,422 tonnes. That's a measure of everything they can carry, including cargo, fuel and other supplies, as well as the crew and their food supplies. But in 2019, Mediterranean Shipping Company, better known around the world as MSC, took delivery of MSC Gulsun, first of a series of container ships which are 399.9 metres by 61.55 metres wide overall. And that makes her and her sister ships the first container ships to be able to stack containers 24 rows wide, a row wider than the existing ultra-large ships. This extra row took her container capacity to 23,756 TEU, over 2,000 more TEU than the existing ships. It's actually around 10% more, but MSC is betting that they can operate the ship for around the same cost as the others, thereby reducing the cost of transport for each box and hopefully increasing their profit margins in a tough and competitive market. MSC Gulsum weighs in with a dead weight of 197,500 tonnes. This ship was built in South Korea by Samsung Heavy Industries and will be followed by five more sisters from the same yard and five more from Daewoo Shipbuilding and Marine Engineering. In October 2019, MSC announced that they will be taking up an option on a further five ships from Daewoo, giving them a total of 16 in the class. The ships have 11 cylinder main engines, generating 66,650 kilowatts of power. That's around 89,000 horsepower, giving them a maximum speed of around 21 knots, although they'll normally cruise at a lower speed. All will be fitted with exhaust scrubber systems, enabling them to continue using high sulphur heavy fuel oil, although they can use low sulphur fuel oil, and they can also be converted to dual fuel operation with liquid natural gas. MSC Gulsun arrived at Felixstowe on the 6th of July 2019 on a so-called ad hoc call, essentially to collect empty boxes to return to the Far East. The UK is not on her scheduled rotation. But the next ship in the series, MSC Isabella, will be a regular caller at Felixstowe and she arrived at the port at dawn on the 5th of October 2019. Ships of this class will be exclusively used on routes between Northern Europe and the Far East, calling only at ports which can handle their 24 rows wide loading pattern. Fully loaded, the ships have a draft of around 16 metres, that's around 52 feet, which means that they're unlikely to ever operate to the USA, where harbours are not so deep. Currently, ships of 366 metres and 13,000 TEU are the largest operating to the USA. Ports that these vessels can call at are already limited by their beam. A 24 rows wide ship means that the ship-to-shore container cranes need a 62 metre outreach to be able to handle containers from any position on deck. So all four of the UK's largest container ports, Felixstowe, London Gateway, Southampton and Liverpool too, can all handle ships this wide. But if ship owners opted to go wider still in the future, with 25 rows of containers across the beam, only DP World London Gateway could handle ships of this size. 
It looks likely that we'll now see an increase in vessels of this size and type. MSC 16 will be joined by 10 more 23,756 TEU ships for Taiwanese line Evergreen and it's unlikely that other lines will want to be left out of the drive to upsize. We'll bring you more news on Shipping TV when we have it.